Bye. Let's just go ahead and bless the video because we're gonna need it. Okay, so a year ago, I saw this, po this post on Facebook looking for Drake and Josh super fans. And I'm like, okay, like I like Drake and Josh. And I read it and it says, looking for Drake and Josh super fans to go on a blind date. I also don't have anything going on romantically. Per usual, let's do it. Um, so I emailed this woman. She gets back to me in like a week or two and she tells me that I got the job. So I'm like, yay. Well, not really a job, but like something to do. Um, but still, yay. So I go in the day of, I'm sitting in this chair, they're testing the lights on me, I'm feeling like I'm doing something. And afterwards they're like, okay, we're waiting for your blind date to get here. We need to put you in a studio um, so you don't see him, a separate studio. So I'm sitting there for like 30 minutes, they come and get me and they bring me back to the initial studio that I was in. So now when I first got there, there were only two people in that studio and that was the producer who I was talking to the whole time um, and the DP light guy. When I come back the second time, the room is filled with people now and when I walk in, everybody's just looking at me like... So that's when I start to get nervous because I can flirt, I can be quirky, like, you know, I can banter, I can be all fun and all that great stuff in small groups you know but then in big groups I just kind of freeze so I'm nervous now I sit back in my seat um, everybody's looking at me and y you'll see wait a minute why would somebody that sounds like this be a fan of Drake and Josh <laughs> yo bro you like started off Australian now you're like some cockney Irish guy Hey, what's up? This is Drake Bell, and I am here at 17. I'm about to meet a super fan, uh, but she doesn't know that I'm here. So, I don't know. Let's do this. This should be interesting. My name is Keon, and I'm a Drake and Josh super fan. I'm not too sure about dating another super fan, or to talk to another super fan of Drake and Josh and see if I want to go on a date from there. But let me just put this out there. If what if my responses weren't concise enough, or it's not it wasn't like phrased the way they wanted me to phrase my sentence. They would rephrase it for me and like make me say that. So my favorite episode is when the movie theater manager, she got her eye surgery. So Ugh. I know her name was Helen. I know her name was Helen. I was nervous and I got what I was saying. Okay. Everything just flew out of my brain. Like it just flew out. So it was, it was Josh basically like chauffeuring her around, like trying to like get everything to work out and it was just a mess because that's typical Josh. What's a weird fact about you most people don't know? A weird fact about me that most people don't know. I'm a really good bowler. Okay. I bowled for like a semester in high school. Yeah. I kind of did this to myself, you know, like I... Who is the best superhero and why? The best superhero? Spider-Man. Because he's, uh, because he's just like this cool teenager that accidentally got superpowers. You know, he's not an alien from another planet. He's not a billionaire. Uh, he just kind of got stuck with this, you know, responsibility that he has to kind of uh, deal with. And, you know, he's, you know, it's cool, co cool conflict and stuff. My favorite superhero. It would have to be Green Lantern. It's not called a chant, but they do this thing with their ring and it starts glowing. So I know that by heart. Prove it. In brightest oh. day and darkest night, no evil shall escape my sight. And for those who worship evils might be where my power, Green Lantern's light. <laughs> what was Megan's best prank? I really liked when she brought the alien, when she hired that guy to dress up like an alien and they scared uh, Drake and Josh when they thought he was a real alien, when they I, dressed yeah. up as a- yeah, I know what you're yeah, talking yeah. about. No clue what he was talking about. I would go on a date. Yeah, you know, just- I feel like we oh, scratched the surface. We scratched the surface, oh yeah. I would- Girl. Yes. How old are you? 21. Yes. Hey.
I'm surprised. <laughs> wow, and you knew it was me. So, like, I really, when I slid the curtain aside, I was just like, shocked. Like, oh my God, like, this is this person that I used to watch on TV, and now they're in front of me. Like, cool. But they wanted me to react like, oh my God, like, oh my God, is that you right in front of me? And I'm just not that kind of person. So afterwards, when I gave my normal reaction, they were like, are you surprised? And I was like, yeah, oh my God, I'm so surprised. And they were like, say it, say I'm surprised. And at that point, I was frustrated because I was getting these sort of line readings the entire time. So I was like, I'm surprised. And that that's what made it onto the clip. Not, oh my God, you're right here in front of me. So yeah, there you go. Wow, and you knew it was me. I didn't. You didn't? I didn't. Oh, good, because I was gonna just—I was trying to disguise my voice at first, and then I got all nervous, and I was like, "This isn't working." But all right, <laughs> sweet. So it didn't. It, you didn't know? No. Awesome. Awesome. That's so cool. Yeah, it's weird, like seeing somebody on TV growing up. Yeah. They're here. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I was. Yeah, I was nervous. I didn't. I don't know. I don't know. Whenever you hear someone that's a super fan or someone that digs your stuff, I don't know. It's kind of. Yeah, you feel like you have something like to prove. Yeah, kind of, you know? Yeah. Like, I don't want to be like, oh, I don't want you to walk away and be like, oh, that guy was kind of, whatever. Yeah, no, I get it. Like yeah, um, as somebody who consistently gets mistaken for Rihanna, I get it. I get him. I like your jacket. You have cool style. Dope shoes. Don't gas me, guys. Dude. I am a mess. Guys, dope. Very cool fashion. I it's am a mess. Mess. <laughs> It's true. Thanks for watching, guys. For more videos like this, subscribe to Seventeen's YouTube.